To put it simply, absolutely yes, because it is industry standard and it is not going away. People have been saying that Excel is dead for many, many years, but it's still going strong, isn't it? I know that there are many tools out there that can handle more data in faster ways. I myself, I can code in SQL and Python, and I use these languages to manipulate and wrangle data. But, and here's the important bit, no matter how good of a coder you are, no matter how beautiful the visualizations you have in Power BI and Tableau, the people around you who interact with data will most likely be Microsoft Excel users, and you will get asked this question. Can I get this in Excel? I think of Excel as the bare minimum of the technical skills that you must acquire if you work in a job where you're exposed to data, which to be fair nowadays is most jobs. If you master the bread and butter Excel formulas such as XLOOKUP, VLOOKUP or INDEX MATCH and some important shortcuts that can significantly speed up your workflow alongside pivot tables and dynamic dashboards using pivot charts, then you're already far more advanced than most Excel users out there. And now let me just move on to three reasons in a little bit more detail of why I think Excel is still one of the most popular data tools out there. First of all, it's got a massive reach with a global community. There's no exact numbers officially published on Excel users, but rumors suggest that the number is around 1 billion. You can easily take advantage of the global community by accessing free online resources such as Microsoft Support, Microsoft Answers Forum, or Stack Overflow. Or you can get some paid online courses on Udemy or Coursera, for example. Now, due to the large number of users, you can bet on Microsoft constantly evolving and updating Excel to keep its customers. Safe to say that it won't be going away anytime soon. Second of all, the interface is intuitive and you can point and click to do whatever you want to rather than having to type out the code yourself to create something. You have the data, the functional logic, the presentation all in one place, kind of like a one-stop shop for data gathering, data manipulation, data visualization, data modeling, exploratory data analysis, and much, much more. And last but not least, Excel is actually quite powerful. Most people think it's not, because they're only utilizing about 1% of its capability. It offers so many features and tools to support power analytics. Features and tools such as formulas, pivot tables, DAX, pivot charts, dynamic arrays, power query, solver, or power pivot. If you enjoyed this video, then a sub to my channel would be great. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.